episode this week is the identity crisis. If you haven't been through one lately, share mine. I'm Jim Stewart. My grandfather, Josiah Kessel, endowed a college named in his honor and left a fund of gold and a few pearls of philosophy. Trouble with most people is they waste half their life trying to find out who they are and the second half denying it. I'm James K. Howard and I teach at Josiah Kessel College, except during semester break like this. No classes, no students, no faculty meetings for a whole week. I'm going to have seven solid days of just being me again. Dad, is it true about toads? There's what? What? Tro toads? What? Jake says they sit on toadstools. I've never seen a toad sitting on a toadstool. Told ya. What do they do, Grandpa? Well, they just croak and hop around and catch flies. What for? To eat. How do they catch them? Well, they have a long tongue and they just sort of flick it out and catch them in midair. How? What do you mean, how? Show us. Well, they just... Mm, and, look, fellas, I've I got some important reading to do. Now, take the toad and get him a square meal. I suggest a garbage can. The homos have a great big one next door. Yeah, out. Jim, the sink is stopped up again. Well, pour some of that gook down it. I did. It just bubbled up and hisses at me. Well, call Coppolis, the plumber. I also did that, but he hisses too, and at $9 an hour. Meanwhile, you come and try, dear. Hello? Yes. Oh, how are you? Oh, uh, well, uh, hang on just a minute. I'll have to check. Did you tell Ralph Woody at the faculty club last Saturday that we're going to play bridge with him tonight? Oh, yeah, yeah. That was before I found out his wife doesn't know a king from a margarine label. Tell him that, dear heart. No, no, you, you get us out of it. I just shuffled. It's your deal, partner. Hi, Woody. Say, I'm awful sorry. I, I've just been called out of town. Yes, it is pretty sudden. But give us a rain check, would you? And I'll call you as soon as I get back. Okay. So long, Woody. You make a liar out of it. For an absent-minded prop, you're sure mighty quick at it. Where are you going, Paris? Oh, I just don't want any more guff from you, woman. You take me away from some nice light reading. Light? Wendy says it's the sexiest book she ever read. Oh, come on, now. Everything's opened up nowadays, dear. What are you, for censorship? That won't help, dear. I tried. It's down in the trap. Oh, no. All you have to do is just put some pressure on it, and then... Yeah. And then the suction pulls it. It's in the trap, dear. Right. You're quite right, dear. I'll get it. Well, it better be Coppolis. A pretty sweet way to start a vacation. Is Professor Howard in? Yes, no, he is, I'm, I'm Jen Morton. Could I see him, please? Oh, he's my counselor at school, and it's terribly important. Yeah, I didn't know you in your vacation outfit. What can I do for you? I'm in terrible trouble, Professor Howard. Oh, well, maybe you better talk to Mrs. Howard. No, no. It's something only you can help me with. I know what I'd do without you. Well, I knew you wouldn't let me down. Like I just knew it, you know? Oh, 
He's so sweet. Oh, like I'm so relieved. I'm like so happy, you know? I mean, like I'm so curious, you know? Oh, well, it's Luther, and she's taking his course and flunked the midterm paper, and she just wants me to talk him into letting her write another. You're not going to, are you? Well, I told her I'd try. Mom, Dad, guess what? What? We put him in a garbage can, Mr. Hummel came out and chased us. Who and what can? The toad. What toad? This one. Oh, Dad told us to. No, I didn't tell you to. Oh, Jake. Jake.